We have a steering concern of the front end shaking, aka the death wobble. So we're going to go through these steering components one by one and talk about which ones are the biggest issue. You go up here to this bushing where the track bar connects to the frame. You can see that bushing has a big split right there. There should be a little bit of movement on a brand new one, but this thing is moving about probably three sixteenths, almost a quarter of an inch. That's too much there. We'll go up here to the drag link and you can see the ball joint here has got about a quarter of an inch play up and down. So you've got a little bit of play here. It looks like they already put a new damper on it, hoping that that would fix the issue, but their steering components are already too worn. So on this passenger side tie rod, this is the second most common place that I'll see take wear because you've got the tie rod connecting here and you have the drag link connecting here. So these bushings take a lot of beating, but you can see this one is articulating up and down probably three sixteenths of an inch. This bottom one's not too bad. It does have some play. There's probably an eighth of an inch of play side to side in this one. So the other things we'll look at is these radius arm bushings. Now I don't see these fail very often. I think you can easily get 300,000 miles out of these before they wear out. There is a very, very small amount of play. I can just feel it pressing on my finger. You can see some cracking in that bushing in there. But I think in this instance, those will be salvageable. And the least common one to fail is gonna be over here on your driver's side. It also has about an eighth of an inch of play. You can see it going up and down as he's turning the wheels side to side. So all those will work together in making this suspension work correctly. If you get play in any of these components, you can start having an issue.